Raiden, shall I activate your pain inhibitors now? No, keep them off. I need it this way. Ah, uh, well, as you wish. I must say, I have turned more than a few men into cyborgs. But you, well, your past is most, uh... What you getting at, Doc? Most of the time, you're working with First World ex-military. Grown men. Compared to the average Third World child soldier, I can't really complain. Most of them, they're the sort of gorillas your typical patient gets paid to slaughter. Uh, perhaps, but, uh... This shouldn't be news to you, Doc. Uh, yes, yes, but, uh... Look, just help me take care of those brains after I bring them back. I do my business, you do yours. Uh, yes. They're pouring in from everywhere. This is crazy. Do not have to fight every enemy you encounter, right? Try and keep moving. Nice of them to blow open the door for me, yeah? <laughs> Idiots. The way is up now, yeah? Almost there. I have just finished analyzing the latest security data. You should find an indoor garden up ahead. A garden? Sounds fancy. A Japanese garden, to be precise. It is an area set aside for VIPs. Apparently, one of World Marshal's directors is a rather serious Japanese culture enthusiast. All right. So what's this got to do with me? Is there something I need from the garden? Not at all. You need only pass through that area to arrive at a freight elevator. I found a route to the elevator controls through the unit we hijacked downstairs. I have located the server room as well. You can reach it via the freight elevator. Great work, Doc. Elementary, my dear Raiden. Now, head for the garden. Yeah! 
good, Raiden. Very good. The main exit is sealed. I very much doubt you can get through there. The catwalk above you was connected to a corridor meant for transporting materials. You can take that to the elevator. It's on you! Walk straight ahead to reach the elevator. My apologies, Raiden. I seem to have fallen behind. No worries. Actually, I should thank you. What are you talking about? If it wasn't for you, I wouldn't have gotten Jack back. Then, that is your true nature. More or less. Still interested? I find no reason to alter my objectives. From the moment we met, you have acted on emotional urges. You speak of protecting those weaker than you. Such people number in the billions. It is impossible. You cannot save every human being in the world. You cannot save every street child. After extended observation, I have come to a conclusion. Your actions are rooted in affinity for those from similar circumstances as yours. Huh. Guess so. Not much of a superhero after all, huh? However, your emotional status is understandable. Perhaps I share this same affinity. Well, if that's what you feel, then glad to have you along. Roger. You can reach the server room via the freight elevator just ahead. 